your OCD, your obsessive compulsive disorder, you have used it in a very positive way in this sport. Mm -hmm. You can use it in a positive way to make you, if you're obsessive about something, you can only think about it days and night all the time. All your life will be oriented towards that goal. For me, it was to make myself a better martial artist. All my life, everything I've done, I've, anything I've done, the reason was to orient myself towards that goal. It's good, it could be a good thing, a positive thing, as it did for making me champion and successful as I am in my sport. But in another another way, it could be a negative thing. It was the same reason why I took my my break, to keep my mental, uh, mental uh, health, because it was driving me crazy. At one point, I couldn't I couldn't keep it anymore. I needed to step out of the uh, of the competition. Otherwise, I would have go crazy, and I felt it. So, it's a good thing, but it could be a bad thing. Yeah, it's new. I play. It's a real movie, you know. Like uh, I did some stuff before, but it was not as big as this. Not as profession professionally done as this. This Captain America, it was a big thing with real movies, you know. I was with Chris Evans, he's my friend Chris Evans, you know. I'm, I've known him before, we went out together in, in New York, you know. But uh, yeah, it was cool, you know, to be with Chris. And, and the guy, they, the stunt guy, they helped me a lot. I did a lot of the stunt myself, but they helped me for some of the crazy stuff, you know, like the, the, the gymnastic thing, they were very incredible. So it was good experience, and I found out, uh, I learned a lot of things, like that, that in movies, the stunt guy, they don't have enough credit. They, they do all the, the hard work, you know? They, yeah. It's crazy, the, the thing rules. they do. Like my, like all the fight scene, it's not the actor that do that, it's the stunt guy. And they're amazing athletes, they're amazing martial artists. And I made, I made a lot of friends in, in, uh, when I went in Los Angeles. I made a, a good group of friends, they're incredible guys. You know? I did, I did my, my stunt myself, but some stuff like a like the crazy thing, I couldn't do it. Like I couldn't, right. I couldn't afford to hurt myself, break my neck, you know. So the guy they did it, but they, they even like Chris Evans, for example, like some of the fight, he don't do himself. It's the right. stunt guy that do everything. It's all the stunt guy. The people think it's the actor. No, it's the stunt guy. They all do their work. It's crazy what they do. I never said I was, you know, that's the thing. And I, I show my good image, but I never said I was perfect. You know, people know I got issues, you know, mental issues, like uh, you know. Things like this. I never said that I was perfect either. You know, I never lied to 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 my fan. You know, to to my supporter, and I don't want to. You know, someone who's perfect is kind of boring. You know, like everybody has a problem. You know, we are we're not perfect, and uh, it's important for me to let it uh, like it is. Like to be authentic. It's always be part of my brand. Be authentic. It's important for me. In his life, he succeed with four things. This guy can do everything he wants. For me, this guy is incredible. He, he can achieve everything he, he, he wants, and for me, that's why he's my idol. He's my main idol, Arnold Schwarzenegger, because of that. You know. So, are you going to run for politics? <laughs> no, 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 no. No, but I'm, I'm saying for his determination when he fixes his goal. I guarantee you, Arnold Schwarzenegger is a OCD. Guarantee you, he is. He's probably obsessive compulsive. He's probably more crazy than I am. Because you cannot achieve this much in your life without being a little bit crazy. You need to put yourself into it. You know, wow. like a lot of controversial stuff happened with him. But but that, for the positive part, like the aura that he has, this man is incredible. You go shake his hand, you feel the aura he has, like the impact he has on everybody. He talked to me when I, like when I first met him. Um, and uh, when I had my knee surgery, I meet Arnold Schwarzenegger. He goes to me, he goes like, shake his hand, he's like, he's like, Mr. Schwarzenegger, I'm a huge fan of yours. And he goes to me, he goes, he touch my elbow, he's like, he's like, good, good, you're looking good. <laughs> I'm like, ah! That was incredible. He touched like, yeah, yeah, he was sitting like this, good, good, you're looking good. I was like, ah! Like freaking out, you know, it's Arnold Schwarzenegger. Like, I couldn't believe it. I was like, wow.